hello 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 everyone welcome back again to my youtube channel if you are new to this channel please subscribe and if you are a returning subscriber thank you and god bless you how are you all doing today my correct correct people will come again with another obunge information from the palace of ife how on a day so according to alleged information reaching us uh following what happened to olobi ronke in the palace of ife uh you know say at times they go they tell you say mad person a person brother or person sister nine b so and the family members then they always cover their face in shame whenever they see uh their own way they could lose somehow so my correct correct people following what happened to her uh, how we heard allegedly that she she was hearing the cry of babies in the palace she ran out in fact so many things that we heard and later later she went to a white garment church they took her to a white garment church initially they they took her to king naomi's church but because there was a restraining order on them okay the security there couldn't allow her to go in so king naomi self did not even see her a lot of people are saying that oh queen naomi rejected her or something but According to what we heard, according to the narrative I'll be waiting, Queen Naomi did not even set eyes on her. It was the security personnel there, okay, that said, oh no, you can't go in because there had been a restraining order for them to come in and go out of the uh, church. You know, there was a time uh, they would come into the palace. They would, uh, as not the palace, into Queen Naomi's church, you find out that they, they didn't even come for anything special. You get they came just to fight Queen Naomi, all right. So, because of that, that was the reason why ah, they are, they are coming in or going out of her church was you know, um, stopped at the moment. So, according to what we heard, her family members had decided to come take her to come pick her up from the palace of Ife. They stormed the palace of Ife and requested that their sister should be handed over to them, okay, that she not do again that uh, uh, the, uh, her, their sister is their sister, irrespective of the kind of person she is or something, that uh, it's better they take her alive, they take her home alive, instead of her being in the palace and, you know, things will go worse. So, my correct, correct people, that was it. So, we had this alleged information and uh, it gets us to take B, okay? And please, in case you're hearing any sound, it is raining heavily, yeah. So my correct correct people, uh, they came to take her. They were like, no, she can't stay back in the palace of Ife again. Though we heard that when they came, when they came to the palace, she refused to follow them, saying that her grave is in the palace. Everything about her that she had invested much in that palace, that there is no way she will be leaving the palace. She will be leaving everything that she had labored for. That all these years she had been laboring to be in the palace of Ife. And when God already finally, finally, finally granted her her heart desire, uh, the devil came in Queen Naomi's form to come and scatter things for her. So, my correct, correct people, she just said a whole lot, as we heard allegedly. But the matter there, we say, her people wanted to take her home. They wanted to, you know, uh, take her back so that all these stories go end. Because in as much as she's bringing bad name to Ileife people, she's equally bringing bad name to her own people, okay? So her people at this point, they don't want, they don't, like, they are no longer engaging in all of those stuff. They are no longer happy with the way waiting state they go on. And they have, you know, stormed the palace to take her. We heard that Kabiesi consented to it, yeah. KBSC told them that, yeah, they took the right decision, they made the right decision, that that was what they were supposed to do, you know, that kind of a thing. Knowing fully well that KBSC had been looking for a way to, you know, discard, the, discard these wives of his. So KBSC approved of uh, them taking her immediately. But all of you wrong care, she said a whole lot, and she equally cried, saying that, okay, look at KBSC that she came into the palace for, that her intentions, everything, was how to make Kabiesi a better person and she had invested so much. Look at how Kabiesi is telling her people to take her back even without a second thought or something. So she was really broken according to what we heard, okay? Yeah, but she would have avoided all of this a long time ago because they knew that Queen Naomi was there before coming in. They should have asked, they would have asked Kabiesi a perfect question then. But they just ignored everything. Even when KBSC was showing them signs 
and everything that he's still in love with Queen Naomi. These women, they played death card. They played as if they played a blind card, doing as if they didn't even notice anything. Okay, look at what is happening now. Now she's crying, saying that KBAC didn't do her well. KBAC didn't treat her right. KBAC this, KBAC that. That KBAC wouldn't they always fall. Do they want KBAC to buy himself for them? No, I want to know. Do they want KBAC to buy himself for them? And not for, you know, all this emotional something on top KBAC head. That man, KBAC, had really tried for these Olores. He don't say where KBS is supposed to send them out. But now because of pity, nine KBS still keep them inside palace. KBS was begging them, you people should leave before it is too late. You people should leave before I do it forcefully. KBS, he no want made something happen to them. He no want made them rub mud on their faces. KBS is trying to protect them, but them, they don't even know that KBS was trying to protect them all this while, all right? So, my correct, correct people, that was it as we heard allegedly. Now, she's trying to bend head for KBS, saying that KBS did not do the right thing. Did not, you know, beg them. I am on to wait now. Somebody that have, like, person get a uh, what's her how go take explain and self why will kbsc plead with her when kbsc no knew that what he has coming in you know is way better than this one now that is about living queen naomi is way better than all of them that are the oloris even 30 30 of them uh, team together cannot even equate to half queen naomi so they should understand that and equally know that the palace is not theirs the palace is not their inheritance. The palace, I don't even know what they are getting from that palace. That if you mention them, if you mention leaving the palace to them, you will see the way they will frown. Eh? You will see the way they will act. The reaction, everything, body language and all of those things will tell you that, oh, they don't want to leave the palace of Ife. I don't really know. I don't really know. I don't know if there is any well of money in there that they are plucking money or is there any tree of money that are plucking money from or any well that they are drawing money from i don't really understand so why they don't want to leave the palace of ife for the rightful owner to come in queen naomi till the kingdom come remains the rightful owner in that palace of that palace that throne where they 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 feel said and they sit on now queen naomi now get gets that throne so the earlier they understand that the better for them let them stop dragging things with Queen Naomi. They are not on the same level. They can never equate to Queen Naomi. That's just it on period. So my correct correct people, that was it as we had allegedly. I don't know if you have given the video a thumbs up yet. If you've not, please kindly give this video a massive thumbs up. Turn on your bell notification so that immediately I upload a new video, you'll be the first to get notified. Also subscribe, alright? So my correct correct people, that was it as we had allegedly. I decided to bring this information to you. If I see more, I'm going to be bringing to your doorstep. Do well to like, share. I'll see you soon. Bye.